The potential for real trouble was on display here at Trinity Bell Woods Park as you had in the early parts of the day long-standing encampments with a lot of demonstrators and supporters surrounding it, locking arms. And basically there was a standoff between city officials and the police backing them and these people that have been living here for maybe a year and a half or so. Now the city decided it was time for them to go and it was a long day. Now they started first by taking out the northern section, the separate section of, an, of the encampments. Dozens of police officers moved through. It went peacefully and it was strategic and there was no one hurt. Then there were several hours of negotiations that took place and eventually, around 6 p.m., there was no more trouble. There was no mass arrest as people feared. In fact, people left peacefully. It seems that they negotiated a deal for the people who've been living in the tents to find permanent housing, and rather than have a fight and all kinds of trauma for the city, it appears that it's ended peacefully. Now throughout the day there's been some heated words, but the police and the security here from Star Security and the city staff, as well as the protesters, have all been very respectful. It's been pretty impressive. Perhaps it should have been done a lot sooner, but it's been handled now and other than three arrests it's been a pretty quiet day. With Ernest Rosick in Trinity Bellwoods Park, Joe Warmington Toronto Sun.